Hi, I'm Pandora. I'm a psychic medium from Chicago. So I've been psychic my whole life. And um, I guess the best way to explain how it feels to me is to help people. I enjoy helping people make it through roadblocks, um, to see things a little bit more clearly in their lives, and to also become more empowered. I like helping people to feel strong in their lives. I've always trusted my instincts. Um, I come from a psychic family, so everybody in my family accepted what they felt and what they um, were able to help people with in the world. It's just always been a part of me. My earliest memory of uh, past lives was a discussion when I was two or three years old with my mom in the car talking to her about when I was here before, and I had very distinct, clear memories of previous lifetimes, and she of course accepted that. And then. Um, when I was eight, my grandmother taught me how to read playing cards. So that's when I got into the art of divination and kind of predicting future events. It wasn't something that I walked around in life talking about, though, until I was in my teens. I think that's when I really felt more comfortable talking to the outside world about it. I have a lot of clients who've been with me for about 30 years, so I've been able to um, help them to navigate the big changes, big um, decision points in their lives. I feel like that's a, a really big part of it for me, is being able to develop relationships with people and to have them um, just be comfortable to share. You know, it's a safe space to talk, and I feel like it's more than just predictions. It's more like a life coach. So some psychics will talk about um, fear and negative things all the time and talk about curses. That's not where I am. <laughs> I come from a very positive down-to-earth place. And it's about getting advice, it's about seeing things more clearly, it's about being able to be prepared for things that are gonna come up. So I like to build trust with my clients by talking about being prepared, like empowering them to be able to see what's coming at them and respond to it better. So in addition to doing readings, so predicting the future, I'm a psychic medium. So I see things, hear things, and feel things, and I also connect with the spirit world and the animal world. So anyone who's crossed over or animals who've gone over the Rainbow Bridge, I can connect with them so people can have kind of that final conversation, final message. And that's part of my work that I'm the most passionate about because I feel like it has a really strong impact.